automobiles personal transportation with almost as many different uses as there are people who own them and no matter what type of car you own or how you perceive it or what car you are considering you are understandably interested in its total efficiency and economy of operation the past decade has seen great change in the automobile as well as in personal driving habits the miles per gallon an engine provides has become as important as the out and out power it delivers As a result of this change in priorities, many new automobiles are lighter in weight and powered by smaller, more fuel-efficient engines than they were several years ago. The 1979 Pontiac Grand Prix, for example, improved its EPA estimated miles per gallon by 46% over the 1975 model. One year can even make a difference, as is the case with Pontiac's 1980 Phoenix, which scores 41% better EPA estimated miles per gallon than its 1979 counterpart. In fact, gone are the days of small, foreign-built cars dominating the fuel economy market. Pontiac's 1979 Sunbird Coupe had an EPA estimated miles per gallon comparable to or better than many of them, including VW Dasher, Toyota Corona and Celica, and the Datsun 510. Even Pontiac's 1979 midsize models, Le Mans, Grand Le Mans, and Grand Am, when equipped with V6 engines and automatic transmissions, offered more EPA estimated miles per gallon than some subcompacts, such as Pinto, Mustang, Capri, and Bobcat. Pontiac's 1979 Catalina, Bonneville, and Bonneville Brome offered better EPA estimated miles per gallon than all other gas-powered full-size cars in America, and that's impressive in itself. But this year, Pontiac has an important fuel economy story to tell as well. Bonneville Brome has a new standard 4.3 liter V8 engine that offers more EPA estimated miles per gallon than last year's larger standard V8 engine. This new fuel efficient V8 is also available for 1980 Firebird, Le Mans, Grand Prix, Catalina, and Bonneville models. But that's not all. Pontiac also adds two other new available engines which offer impressive performance and fuel efficiency. For the sporty car enthusiast, Pontiac introduces a totally new, highly efficient turbocharged V8, which is available in this year's formula and Trans Am. It's the industry's first turbocharged V8, proving once again that Pontiac is a leader. For those who enjoy the luxury of a full-size car or station wagon, but are feeling a pinch at the gas pumps, this year's full-size safaris and Bonneville Bromes offer a diesel engine which provides impressive fuel economy as well as the smooth ride you'd expect from a full-size car. Diesel engines are gaining widespread acceptance for use in passenger vehicles and the reasons why are obvious. Not only do they have a higher estimated miles per gallon rating than gasoline engines of similar size, but diesel fuel has traditionally cost less than unleaded gasoline. A diesel engine may actually cut your average annual fuel cost by as much as 25%. That's a considerable savings and a real plus for this year's full-size Pontiacs. Overall maintenance costs are less, too. In a diesel engine, there are no spark plugs, distributor, points, condenser, carburetor, ignition system, or wiring to ever need tune-ups. This means that a diesel-equipped Pontiac can offer you savings in both time and money. The available 5.7 liter diesel engine uses a basic 350 cubic inch V8 block design with the block and major components strengthened to handle its higher compression ratio of 22.5 to 1. This high compression ratio generates heat which in turn creates spontaneous ignition. At exactly the right moment in each compression stroke, the fuel injector pump injects a precise amount of fuel into the pre-chamber where ignition begins and continues on into the combustion chamber. This diesel engine is very easy to operate. With a slight turn of the key, a glow plug heats air in the pre-chamber and readies the engine for ignition. Every diesel equipped Pontiac features expanded sound deadening insulation under the hood and newly designed poppet injection nozzles in the engine to help quiet the operation. And the pre-chamber, which is a special feature of this engine, helps provide quick response 
easy acceleration and a smooth ride remarkable for a diesel. As a matter of fact, there may be no better way to experience Pontiac's stunning full-size luxury than with the kind of economy this diesel engine can offer. And as with all Pontiacs, the proof of performance is an on-the-road test drive. On the other hand, you may see yourself in a sportier car, one with the performance tradition of Pontiac's Trans Am. If so, you'll be interested in the new turbocharged engine, which is available in the Formula and Trans Am. It's a high-performance version of the 4.9-liter V8 that's standard in this year's formula. And performance, in the case of a turbocharged engine, means efficiency as well as power. And here's how. Turbocharging turns wasted energy into a power source. As you drive, hot exhaust gases accumulate in the manifold and activate the turbo which delivers a pressurized charge of air-fuel mixture into the cylinder for more power on the firing stroke. This enables the turbocharged engine to deliver greater accelerating power without consuming excessive fuel during normal cruising. The turbo engine features a wastegate which controls boost pressure and is specially set to provide high input while controlling engine wear. It requires no periodic adjustment or special tuning and helps provide consistent performance. The turbo also features an electronic detonation feedback spark control, which retards spark timing to help control knock. There are other advantages to the turbocharged V8 as well. Because it utilizes exhaust gas to add power to the engine only when needed, there are less hydrocarbon and carbon monoxide pollutants during acceleration than with naturally aspirated engines of similar performance. Engine power isn't wasted to draw pistons down on the intake stroke and it offers impressive fuel economy for a performance engine. Ask your Pontiac sales representative for the 1980 EPA estimated miles per gallon for the 4.3 liter V8 turbo and diesel engines. You'll be very surprised by the fuel economy estimates and total performance they offer. And whether it's fuel efficient V8 power, turbocharged for added performance, or a diesel for good fuel economy, Put yourself behind the wheel of these impressive new Pontiacs and experience firsthand their powerful, quiet, smooth ride. The 4.3 liter V8, the 4.9 liter turbo, the 5.7 liter diesel. Three important new engine choices from Pontiac in 1980, where you get more Pontiac excitement per gallon. <laughs>